Jay Harris coming to you from Tom's Trading Room. I had a student a while back email in and ask me how they can find which specific index or sector that a stock is in. Is there a website or a place that they can go to find that information out? Now I'm sure there are many of them out there, but our tools does that type of work as well. So let me show you how this happens. It's funny because I was going to do a stock analysis presentation on sectors. So I'll put your cursor on stock, stock analysis, click on sectors, and that question coincides with this subject matter. As you see here, we have two boxes, one for major sectors, one for minor sectors. They're listed alphabetically. Over here under sector settings, it's sorting the options analysis list by the major sectors and is doing so by those sectors alphabetically. Now you can hide these boxes if you like by clicking on the hide major sectors and minor sectors line items. I like to bring them back, so I'll click on the show major and minor sectors line items. Down below you see that the display options, uh, the current options analysis list is for the pennies and weeklies list. You can go ahead and change it to whichever you like there with a the drop down arrow. And we're finding sectors for the selected options analysis list. You can find the optionable stocks in the majors and minors there as well. Underneath, here's your list. You have IMAX, BP, UPL. They are listed by way of what sector they're in and how it comes up first alphabetically. That's all there is to it. Now, to find the specific stock and what sector it's in, it's a little bit tricky so let's show you how to do that go up to websites go to your lists click edit list what you're going to do is change the list from the pennies and weeklies to a list number that's there let's just go with list two pick any list number list two three four five six it doesn't matter click list two and it will repopulate the screen and you'll see that there are no symbols in that list so if you want to do it on just one specific stock, let's say Apple, A-A-P-L. I think you guys all know it's a technology stock, but is it any more specific than that? So as we type in A-A-P-L, let's go ahead and click Save. And it now is a list to, let's even do this. Let's edit the list name to uh, specific ticker uh, sector search. So once you type that in, Name it anything shorter if you like. I just can't think of anything shorter at the time being. So specific ticker sector search. Let's go ahead and save again. And now we have the selected stock list with that name. What we want to do now is go back to stocks, go back to analysis, and go back to sectors. Now instead of having the pennies and weeklies listed under your current options analysis list, it's specific ticker sector search. Or go find it wherever it's listed on that list. Now that you have that, click on the Go button for finding the sector for the selected options analysis list. When you do that, it's only going to search out Apple. And so here you go. There's Apple down below. It's commercial machinery and computer equipment, the minor sector computer and office equipment. So it's a little bit more specific that way. So now all you have to do is just go back to that specific uh, ticker search and edit that list with a new ticker symbol and run the search once again to find its specific sector or industry. Hope you found that educational, enjoyable. Keep posted on the discussion boards that are coming your way and we'll talk to you soon.